Thanks for tuning in for uh, an update from the Essential RC YouTube channel. I'm Dom. I'm helped on this channel by my good friends, James, Jason, Al and Tom. Uh, but this is a short update on uh, a new project that I am starting today. Uh, now typically what you will have seen on the Essential RC YouTube channel is that I do basically two things. Um, I travel around to shows, uh, more recently went to Germany to the airliner Treffen show where I met Remy, uh, uh, Remy of the Remy RC wave uh, channel where he flew his um, amazing airliner, the Boeing Treble Seven Nine X. Really fantastic to see that. So I, but I go to shows and I film things like that, uh, and I also uh, do flight tests of things that I'm sent and other things that I buy from Hobby King or Banggood and a number of other companies. And now, having met Raimi and seeing the level of effort that that guy goes to in designing and building and flying magnificent airliners like that, I thought it was about time the Essential RC YouTube channel did its own, uh, its own build. Now, I, I do not have the skills, the patience uh, to design something from scratch. So I've been looking since I got back from Germany at uh, a project that we could take on over, over winter and hopefully complete by next spring summer. Now when I was on Facebook this picture popped up of uh, this rather good looking uh, lady holding an SR-71 Blackbird. Um, now I saw an SR-71, a twin turbine, no it's actually a lie, it's a single turbine powered SR-71 at the airline uh, Treffen show and uh, I thought it'd be brilliant if um, I could cr uh, create something like that but there aren't kits around for that except for what was behind this picture that I saw on Facebook and I clicked on that and it goes to a website called Aero Tetris. Now if you've heard of the Tetris game you will know that it works by different shapes coming down from the top of the screen you basically have to fit them into layers and as you complete a layer it disappears and you carry on going until all the you you don't fit them together and you get to the top and it ends. So this these models from Aero Tetris work in the same way you basically have to construct them from cross sections um, cross sections rather than traditionally getting the wings and the fuselage um, this comes in cross sections so uh, made of foam so um, this uh, this is his uh, this his website and it's actually been going for a number of years I maybe 10 years ago I knew about Aero Tetris but I'd kind of forgotten about him but he's got a massive catalogue of of models on his website now so um, Aviojet and an F4 Phantom, SU-30, there are the rows, so and maybe 50 different models. Not all jets, incidentally, some fixed wing models as well. But the SR-71 itself comes in three different sizes. There's the 1.68 meter long version, the small version, the 2.24 meter version, medium version, but I thought Essential RC should go for the big version, the 2.8 meter long uh, version, that this lady was holding in the picture. So this kit has arrived, this is it. It arrived from Spain a couple of days ago and it contains 800, about 850 pieces of foam that you have to glue together and then all put your electronics and your power system in, retracts and all that type of stuff and, and paint to make it look like the SR71. So that's, this is the project that uh, we're taking on over the next few months. I'm hoping that we'll have it finished by next spring or summer. Um, it's going to be a, a bit of a challenge, but we're going to give it a go. Hopefully my friends will uh, give me a help. Uh, I don't know how it's going to be powered. Uh, in his picture on the website, he shows the plan view uh, here, and you can see that he is showing it with uh, a 90mm and a 120mm EDF options. But I am wondering whether it could be powered by two micro jet turbines, maybe two 20 to 45 Newton engines put right in the back of the tails if I mount them on, on some, some ply mounts. I think that might work. I've seen other jets. Uh, for even foam jets converted to run off jet turbines in that way. But 
We don't need to decide that yet. I think the first thing will be to put the foam fuselage and wings together and plan out the installation of the electrics. But anyway, that's to let you know that is our big project and I will be doing a sequence of videos as we progress through the build and would appreciate your input, your feedback, any constructive uh, input into how we might progress with the project would be great. So that aside, now here's another little surprise. I'm doing a free giveaway. Thank you very much for watching this video. So we're gonna start a sequence of free giveaways. All you have to do, all you have to do is leave a comment on this video and uh, be subscribed to the Essential RC YouTube channel at the time we make the draw. We're gonna make the draw in two weeks time from the time this video is published. That date will be in the video description and any other terms and conditions. We are giving away this time the Boeing 747 that we got from Banggood a while ago and we had a lot of fun flying this. It comes with everything that you need in the box to get flying, less the four AA batteries that you need to put in the transmitter. But these are a lot of fun. They're practically indestructible and you can have a lot of fun. You don't even need to be able to fly. It's at the toy end of the market, admittedly. But um, regardless, of, it says 14 plus. Um, but really, you could fly this if you were five years old under the supervision of an adult so you don't cut your little fingers on the propellers. But these are a lot of fun. So we're going to give things away like this over the next few weeks. So remember, uh, leave a comment. That comment could be um, feedback about, hopefully, feedback about the channel, things you like, maybe things you don't like. But any constructive input would be appreciated. But remember, at the time of the draw, you have to be subscribed. So please do that. Uh, that's it. So thanks very much for watching this Essential RC update. Uh, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for viewing the, uh, the videos that I, I put out. It's much appreciated. Hope to see you soon. <laughs> what is he doing? <laughs> I don't know, but it was impressive. Can you do it again? downwind, I don't know how he was doing that.